What's going on, everybody? Crazy Dog back with another video. And I got some Browns news to report. Now, this happened during my Indian stream. So, obviously, I could not report on it immediately after it happened. But today, the Browns officially traded Emmanuel Ogba to the Kansas City Chiefs in exchange for safety Eric Murray. Now, uh, we knew all along Emmanuel Ogba was involved in trade discussions. And then we found out today that he did not show up to voluntary workouts. So we knew something was probably going to happen at some point. And sure enough, during the Indians game, it was announced that he was traded to the Chiefs for safety, Eric Murray. Now, looking at Murray's stats and background, he was drafted in 2016 with the 106th overall pick in the fourth round out of the University of Minnesota. And uh, so far in his career, he has 99 total tackles, one sack, seven pass deflections, one interception, and one fumble recovery. Now, if you ask me, I think Murray is more of a depth guy. I don't really see him as a legit starter. I think he would be able to come in and uh, be good on certain plays. But uh, he's played in almost every game. He's played in 45 games, started 11. And he isn't too bad. I mean, uh, I kind of figured we were going to probably uh, trade for a safety or sign one when we just got rid of Derek Kindred today as well. And knowing John Dorsey, he could easily sign another one. Or the more the more likely thing he does is drafts one. I think he's gonna draft one, maybe with that second round pick that we have. So uh you know, to Emmanuel Agba, you know, good luck in Kansas City. I'm gonna miss you, man. Uh, you were one of my uh low-key favorite players. But the thing about Emmanuel was he really wasn't a straight up pass rusher. He was a good one stuffer though. And he was very good at batting balls down. But he just could not rush the passer. And it really didn't help that he's had to battle some injuries. And uh, hopefully he blossoms in Kansas City. I mean, looking at Ogba's career so far, 122 tackles, 12 and a half sacks. That's not bad. Like, he's not a total bomb. But he just really wasn't much when it comes to pass rush. And now that we got Olivier Vernon, some people thought, hey, move Agba inside. I thought that could be a good idea. But clearly, you know, uh, Dorsey wanted to get something for him. And uh, we got a safety for him. So we'll see how this works out. So that's going to wrap this video up. Just figured I'd come on here real quick and talk about the trade. Of course, it happened during the Indians game while I was streaming. And uh, talked a little bit about it then, too when it first happened, but uh, we'll see what happens with Duke Johnson too. I actually heard today that his reps have requested a trade. So we'll see how long it takes him to get traded. I'm going to say at least a week. Hopefully uh, we get something good for him. I would love Darren Lee from the Jets. I always loved Darren Lee from Ohio State, man. I know he wanted us to take him in the draft, but we didn't. Hopefully, uh, you know, we can uh, get something good for Duke. I'm going to miss him too, man. Love Duke, but hey, you know, it's a business, and uh, I understand why he wants to be traded because he would be in a backfield with Chubb and Hunt, although I'm pretty sure Freddie would find uh, snaps for him, and he would be able to get him the ball, unlike Hugh Jackson, who for some reason could not figure out how to get him the ball. That still irks me to this day, but what are you going to do? So, uh, yeah, if anything else happens, I'll come on and make a video about it, but... Uh, for the time being, I'm Crazy Dog 99. Let's go Browns, and I will see you in my next live streamer video. All right, I'm out.